Oh, sh**. What time is it? It's time for the Royal Goose. Hey guys, welcome back. I actually You know what? Fuck you, Ellie. Sorry guys, we were fighting off screen. <laughs> yeah, fucking kung fu fighting. I threw him out of my fucking window. He came back with a fucking chain, whipped it around his head and like smashed me in the nose with it. Then I fucking oh. took out a fucking uh food purifier and I blended up some carrots and then I like shot it into his mouth and he's like, "No, I'm allergic to healthy things." And then he fucking back kicked me in the mouth, but it wasn't him. He actually hired a horse and got the horse to kick me and then he shot out my teeth with the back kick. So then I picked up picked up my teeth and then I fucking became Peppy Pig and then and then that's all folks. Peppy Pig. Yeah, I'm Peppy pork, Pig. It's Porky Pig. Not Peppy Pig from the the cartoon show. It's porky, you fucking retard. No, there's a Peppy Pig. I'm the, sorry, that's not a nice word. Fucking isn't it, idiot. Isn't it Peppy the Pig the from the like kid Peppy. show what kid show i don't know isn't there a peppy pig you're just making crap up peppa, right now peppa who's peppa peppa the pig what are you talking it's from about? a kid show okay you know what james fine hey, google fuck you google come on show me fucking here i got you dog watch uh, this okay i can here. well who's peppy who, fuck no <laughs> <laughs> who's peppa the pig <laughs> Oh, Peppa oh Pig. that guy. Oh. It's Peppa Pig. Yeah, but you were talking like Porky. Peppa, 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 Peppa. You, you were talking I, I was, and then it was like funny Porky. because I was getting the wrong person because I was mixing up all my words and it was fucking great. Okay, so anyways, what we were arguing about off screen, some tears were shed, just so you know. <laughs> Not mine. So while I took... I got him. Okay, while I took forever to find the freaking uh, image from the Metroid Prime booklet, I managed to find it. So here is the story to Metroid Prime. As in the booklet, the Chozo. In fact, here's a picture on screen, real the quick. The Chode Show. Let's see. I'll give you the TLDR. What does that stand for? Too long. Didn't read. Okay. Well, okay. The Chozo over millennia. The bird. You fucking reading it. Race of. You know what? <laughs> like, I'm gonna give you the shortened version. Yeah, but I. Yeah, the but too you know long. What? Didn't read, and then you're just <laughs> reading word for word. You're like, okay, I'm gonna summarize this for you. Now that you and on it, page one, it began. Now that <laughs> you mentioned it, the Lord said, "Let there be." Okay. And so there was. Uh, you know, I was trying to be considerate, but yeah, no, you're What do you right. do, like, fucking take out one word? Oh, no, it's okay, I cut out one word. Okay, uh, the Chozo. Over millennia, this bird-like race of creatures made incredible technological and scientific leaps. Traveling at will through space, they built many marvels across the universe. Technological wonders of unfathomable, fat, unfathomable <laughs> complexity and cities unmatched in beauty. They shared their knowledge freely with more primitive cultures and learned to respect and care for life in all its forms. Wow, these sound like cool guys. Even sound as like fucking nerds. Even in horrified but increasing violence. Huh. So a bunch of bad shit happened. A years passed. A great meteor crashed into Talon Four. Yeah, Talon Four. Sending a sending That's a matter. Blah, blah, blah. Most plants and animals died, while others mutated into hideous forms. Oh, that's sad. Mm, that's hot. The Chozo called upon all of their knowledge and technology to control the power of the Phazon, but their efforts were doomed to fail. All they could do was build a temple over the crater at the impact site, separate separate the Phazon core, and seal it away. Believing that someday, a savior would return to the planet. Oh, shit! Oh, Jesus. Oh, it's... Oh, okay, that's fine. Oh, it's this guy again. Oh, you're back here. Yep. Oh. Okay, so they believe out, the, dude. they believe somebody would come save them. Oh, dude, Michelin. <laughs> Michelin man. Spooky, dude. Jeez, this is the freaking episode. Spooky, spooky, spooky. Okay, this is the episode of freaking speech impediments. First, yeah. you were talking like freaking Roger Rabbit, then Porky Pig, and then Roger saying, Rabbit? "Yeah, because you were like, I go, I, 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 I can do this because you know." Th 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 th. He has like a what's it called? A stutter. Well, a stutter is like poop, 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 that, 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 that's all, folks. Please. Yeah. I guess they're both stutters. Yeah. Okay. Anyways, the space pirates. Space pirates. Blah blah blah. Ah oh, shit. I don't want to spend too much time on this. So, space pirates research Metroids. Blah blah blah. Okay. So this is not where I need to be. Okay. Here's where it gets to Samus. Samus Aran. Don't Aran. A, a Chozo made. Samus Aran. Er yeah, whatever. <laughs> Aron. Er, Aron. Donned a Chozo made power suit and cut a swash through the space pirate's operation, destroying everything in her path, including the gargantuan mainstays of the space pirate army, Ridley and Craid. She eventually made it to the core of their base, destroyed all the Metroids she saw, and seemingly blew up the mother. Oh, oh yeah, that's a reference to the first game. But blah blah blah, the space pirates were far from done, as they mined the Phazon. 
Into the opening shit. I don't know where this Cool! Is. So space pirates, we fucking blow them up and shit. Convoluted story. Space. Okay, so Samus tracked the space pirate ships to this planet that we're at right now, and uh -huh. she is preparing to wipe them out once and for all. But there are two sequels to this game, so that probably doesn't happen, but then again, I don't know shit about Metroid, so... Got it. So this game is about the space pirates. Uh, I guess so. The, okay. I mean, I did skip a lot of crap when I was reading yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, but that's... <laughs> <laughs> so what, maybe I'll read it in my spare time. But right now, we're doing a show, so... <laughs> oh, now you get it. Now you get it. <laughs> hey, man. You gotta switch, spice things up a little, you know? Spice uh, things up in the bedroom. And by bedroom, I mean... This is the fucking bedroom, this goddamn couch. Or living room or whatever. That, <laughs> so, are you saying we can't fuck on a couch? Yes. This is a sacred place for... Eating fucking pizza. Hey James, question for you. Yes. Is it a sin? We're, we're about to lose half our subs here. Is it a sin? <laughs> okay. <laughs> to put pineapple on pizza. Uh. God damn it. Uh, in my opinion, well. God damn it. Uh, I want to say yes, but on the other hand, some people like that. So the douchey part of me says yes, it's a fucking sin. Fuck you. Go choke on your own dick if you like pineapple on pizza. But then the sane part of me says no, nah, bro. Do what you want, man. Why? Pineapple pizza is the fucking best. Go fucking choke on your own dick. Love it. <laughs> okay, so this is where we're supposed to be, but I'm supposed to use the fucking crawling butthole weird thing <laughs> to get up here. Why? How? Am I doing this wrong? Okay. Dude, Tony Hawk Pro Skater. Samus when do Aaron I want to edition. Boost right there. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Samus Aaron. Samus Aaron, Aaron Carter. <laughs> yeah. Do you remember that guy? Oh, fuck yeah, dude. Is My... he still doing stuff? Um, yeah. Hi. We definitely would never say anything that might make our viewers upset. No, I wouldn't. We also wouldn't say anything that might give out any personal information of anyone we know. <laughs> so I'm up here, and we gotta... Yes, he... I think he might still be making music. Should All I remember from him is... He, 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 he did a song for uh, the Jimmy candy. Neutron movie. Back oh, yeah, he did sing I Want Candy, didn't he? Yeah. He he, he 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 did a song for the Jimmy Neutron movie. Okay. Alienation. And then uh, the song I remember most from him was... I can't remember what it was called, but it was... Shaq? Everybody How sing, sing a lie. Something, something, something. What? What? Say it again, say it again. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> to yeah. the left, to the right, make noise. Yeah. You know what I'm talking about, right? How I Beat Shaq. How I Beat Shaq. I think that's the song. Wait, Shaq as in like... Yeah, Shaquille O'Neal. How I Beat Him? How, yeah, in basketball. He's like rapping about, like, not rapping, but he's singing about how he <laughs> beat Shaq. Oh, double jump! Yes! Wait, but it's obviously a story, like a fake story, right? Yeah, it Okay. Is. <laughs> yes, he was like a fucking 13-year-old boy at the time. There's no way he's gonna fucking beat Shaquille O'Neal. Well, I don't know, maybe he's secretly like Elastigirl or something. And he no, can, I was kidding, he, he actually did. It was he like, can grow like 50 feet tall and... No, I'm not kidding. There, there actually was a part where they like they played some thing and he got some bonus and he beat him. So he wrote a song about it. Yeah, because he beat him. Is it like douchey at all? You just you were repeating parts of it. Well, yeah, yeah but I don't remember the lyrics perfectly. So yes. All I remember Aaron is the Carter melody. Aaron Carter beat Shaq one on one. Okay, but I'm sure. Just it, fucking kidding. Gotcha. Of course. <laughs> you know, you gotta. I gotta learn to take, not believe everything you say. Yep. It's something. That, that's real talk. That's actually something. I'm a very gullible person. No. That's actually so Fuck you! <laughs> Fuck you. you. You haven't started choking on your own dick yet. G get to it, my slave. Um, so, um, yeah. Like, growing up, I've always been kind of gullible, and I could... Like, there were times where it's like, okay, I think they're kidding. But there's always that tiny bit of me that's like, wait, they could be telling the truth. And then they're like, no, we're fucking kidding. It's like, god damn it! <laughs> god uh... I, I always know. fall for it. I was surprised because when we started hanging out a lot again, you like you brought that up and stuff, but I don't remember you being that gullible in high school and stuff. <laughs> really? Yeah. Well, I mean, we only... Like, Just kidding. <laughs> oh my god! My god! Oh! You fucking... I'm sorry, man, I had to... Ah, I'm just gonna strangle you! <sighs> <laughs> well... No, uh, okay. What an episode. <laughs> I do, oh, after boy. you brought it up, it, this is 100, <laughs> it would be fucking rude for me to continue right okay. now. I okay. don't, I didn't remember that being one of your traits, but after you brought it up, I did remember. remember. Yes. Okay. 
That is not a lie. Fuck me. I will quit Royal Coops if that's a fucking lie. Okay. I, Wait. I. Are you crossing your fingers behind your back? Oh, no, no you're not. But you're, I did you're... tie my penis in a knot. Does that count? You can do that? 